If you find this video interesting, then please like and share it. Also, leave your comments below. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel and click on the bell icon for notifications. Let's study construction and working of a photodiode. It is a diode which is always operated in a reverse bias mode. Due to reverse bias, it has a very wide depletion region. While using the photodiode light is made to incident on the junction. The photons incident on the junction generate electron hole pairs as shown in the diagram. Being in the reverse bias mode, holes get attracted towards the P region by negative terminal of the battery and electrons get attracted towards the N region by positive terminal of the battery. We know that in a reverse bias mode, reverse saturation current flows through a diode. Thus, increase in the charge carriers leads to increase in the reverse saturation current. This current is called as a photocurrent. With increase in the light intensity, more electron hole pairs are generated and the photocurrent increases. Thus, photocurrent is proportional to light intensity. What do we mean by dark current? It is the current flowing through a photodiode in the absence of light. Dark current flows due to the thermally generated minority carriers and hence increases with the increase in temperature. Think over, why are we operating a diode in reverse bias? During reverse bias, only reverse saturation current flows through the diode, which is in microampere range. The photocurrent that gets generated is also in microampere range. Thus, we can easily identify change in the diode current after generation of a photocurrent. On the other hand, if we operate the diode in the forward bias, then the diode current is in the range of milliamperes. Thus, a photocurrent of few microamperes won't create any effect on the diode current. Thus, we operate a photodiode in a reverse bias mode always. Let's see the advantages and disadvantages of photodiodes. Advantages of photodiodes are high sensitivity and high speed of operation. Disadvantages of photodiodes are poor temperature sensitivity. Dark current increases with increase in temperature. External biasing is required. Amplification is required as output is small. If you find this video interesting, then please like and share it. Also, leave your comments below. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel and click on the bell icon for notifications.